Hey man, what's up? Oh, hey, sorry, I called the wrong person. It's okay, Despacito. Yeah, true. Alright, good night. I don't have any friends. I got this tweet about an hour ago from Despacito Dorito Lover 9, and he said, Hey retards, your videos are horribly mediocre and I hate you as a person, but Steam keys are on sale, fuck you. So since I also love Despacito, I figured I'd actually go and check out what this guy was talking about. And uh, sure enough, the uh, the premium Steam keys on Kingwin are on a, a, a sale right now, and I have air quotes over the sale because they're trying to tell me that you can get five premium random Steam CD keys for $5.79 which that's like the normal price, okay? That's what I've always bought them for. They're trying to tell me that this costs $52.18. 52, the one above it is $104. Give me a break. Well, I'm sold, buddy. Today we're gonna buy five of these premium random Steam keys and see what kind of premium random quality entertainment we get. But little do they know, I'm scamming them today, boys. You can see they are 9.15 right now, but if I go all the way down to the bottom here, I can get them for $5.79. Uh, so that's what we're gonna do. Oh, actually, this guy's name is Weed Keys. We're gonna buy them from him. I don't need no buyer seller protection. I'll be fine. <laughs> I'm buying from a guy named Weed Keys. He's the most trustworthy person in the world. Like, are you kidding me? Drugs are the devil, and I refuse to go near them. Look at that. Thanks to this Chrome extension I have, I saved an extra 23 cents with code Spilakov. So, uh, that's thanks, thanks to whatever Russian guy made that. So, this cost me a whopping $6.13. We just got a whole meal for the price of a snack. This is gonna be a fantastic video, and I can't wait to play all these games. Can't you tell how excited I am, boys and girls? I have girl fans. Oh, it looks like these are the games that we got today. I'm gonna redeem these all real quick, and then we're gonna see how quality all this content actually is. I'm pretty excited for dashing dinos. That looks that looks like a great time. All right, so all the keys are in, and these look like really, really quality games, bro. I'm really excited for Acceleration of Suguri 2. Let's actually, let's start with that one. Oh yeah, this is this is super Asian. So we got a story mode. Uh, for players seeking the ultimate thrill, you wanna get hard. Let's go normal. Wow, wow, this is like really, really, really Asian. I bet you somehow, somewhere, there is a very, very intricately described bio for every single one of these characters. I'm telling you, bro, Sham has quite the backstory. Look at this girl, man. She could be a trap, okay? You see how loose that skirt is? That's a trap. That's a man in woman's clothing right there. We're gonna play as K because big titty golf girls. Look, <laughs> looking for stuff. Humdy dum. You look quite chipper, bro. I can't. I, okay, we're gonna. We're just gonna go right, right through this. I'm not doing this. What is? What is? What? How do you? Okay, you you fight with the arrow keys. What is this? How do I? How do I attack? What is? Go what is going on? This is like. This is like anime smash. I don't move list. Why? Why is the H key a control here? That should not be. I don't. This doesn't work. What is happening? What is going on here, man? Okay, that's a, that's enough. I'm not doing that. So this next game is called Goner, and this actually looks more promising than the weird uh, <clears throat> anti fight club. Yep, this is uh. What? So I'm a blob and there's a whale following me and there's little onions. Oh, I guess I gotta jump off the onions. What do these do? I got I got a little blue, got a little power up ball. I don't really 100% know what's happening here, but I'm kind of digging it, man. I'm not even gonna lie. You jump on the little onions, you get the little, the little ball cube square things and then you pet the whale. Oh, now I'm hanging from a tree. Now I got a skeleton head. Now there's three of us petting a whale. That thing just shit me out. Oh, I have a gun now. Saw, dude. Okay. Found an ammo crate. Okay, this game's starting to get interesting. Let's see what we can do. Let's jump into this butthole. This is a lot more intense than it was a minute ago. Dude, I'm the best. I'm <laughs> I'm the best at everything. Like, what's up, dude? How you doing? You're dead. Okay, okay. Oh, you got little sliding fetuses on the wall? That's cool. That's cool. You're dead. See you in hell, buddy. Yeah, you're dead. Oh, a little snail on the wall. Oh, what's up? What's up, buddy? You're dead. You're dead. Dead. Take that ammo. Jump in this butthole. Next level. Let's get it. What is going on? Okay. So Goner is a roguelike dungeon crawler, and basically all you do is kill flying bugs and grab their little square life force things, as well as ammo from the random stuff that drops. And if you get hit, you turn into a floating little butthole and then have to pick up your body parts. 
I'm not good at this game. By the looks of the death screen, you are able to unlock and change your weapon, uh, as well as your body parts later on down the line. However, I'm really bad at dungeon crawling games, so I didn't even try and get that far. The game has a pretty cool art style, and honestly, if you're into this kind of game, I really don't think the gameplay is that bad. It handles smoothly, and it's actually a pretty cool experience. So I'll have everything linked in the description below if you guys want to check it out. Next polished turret on the list is called Parvene, the leg legacy of the light's guardians. And let's see if we can turn up the resolution because this is awful. We can't. What's the point of an option menu if you just see the credits and the how to play? Okay, let's uh, let's start a new game here. This looks really good. Is this a search and find game? Tell me right now this isn't a search and find game. Is this ancient Nordic? What language is this? <laughs> can somebody in the comments tell me what language this is? Hold up. I broke I broke it. I broke the game. This is oh god. Holy shit! This game open world? I really wish I could skip this cutscene. Really wish really wish I could just go right past the cutscene. It's been it's been going for five minutes, can't skip the cutscene. <laughs> Oh, is the cutscene finally done? Alright. I guess I'll get back to work. Is there a way to change the language here? Can we can we do that? Absolutely not. Alright. <laughs> is that raw sewage in the water? Someone just shit in the water and just left it there? That's really uh it's really intelligent. You click to drag, but you're what? Oh, okay, so it's like it's like it interacts with my mouse as well as the player, because I can move this with him not there. Okay. Okay. Defend the house. How am I? I'm like 10. How am I supposed to do that? Oh, I know. I'll run him over with this cart. Okay. There we, I, I contributed. My new quest is to talk to my talk to my father. Hey, father. What's bracken, cuz? Oh, they're coming out of the water. There's one right next to you. There's dad. There's one. There's one. He's swaying. I guess he's waiting for us to stop talking. How how considerate. What a great what a great batch of monsters. These are. They interact with the environment really well, and they're they're really hard to kill. They do a lot of a lot of health damage to you. Why are we killing these? What is what is the issue here? Why are we? These are just like dogs. They're just it's just doing what I ask it to. Just okay. What is what is the objective here, man? What is going on here? Why is there so much broken shit in my yard? You can't go anywhere. What am I supposed to be doing? This feels like the Neopets game for the PSP. Did any of you guys play that? Because I, I played that. That's what this is. This is Neopets. Oh, I figured it out. To get through, we got to move the wagon. That's that's some engaging gameplay right there. Yup. Yes, siree. Ooh wee, that's really, wow, that's, wow, oh, more butthole monsters. I'm just gonna stand here, cause they don't actually attack. Look at how much damage they're doing to me. They're just, they're just, do, oh wait, actually shit, they are, they are doing damage to me, okay. <laughs> oh, we made it, I made it to the quest. We, we got a, we got a load, we got a load screen. We're in Raid's house. God, my character is ugly. I bet you this is where I get a weapon. I bet you there's gonna be a sword laying on the ground. Oh, sure enough. <laughs> That's fucking stupid. Press the left click to defend yourself. Oh, wow. Okay, we're crafting now. Is this Sudoku? What is this? What the hell is this? This is literally Sudoku. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm, I'm playing math games right now. Are you serious? You guys are lucky I'm good at math games. Otherwise, this would be a huge issue. Man, and that's got two. Bam. What did I do wrong here? Why am I playing math games with pieces of wood anyways? This is stupid. Whoever designed this is stupid. I just had to play Sudoku so I can make a wooden sword. Are you serious? Oh no, they just, they destroy. I'm bored with this game, goodbye. So it turns out that the fourth key that I got was not even, wasn't even a game key at all. This is, this is some DLC right here. Oh, it's a Steam Early Access. How do I have a beta key for, what? This gave me a beta key for this game. What the hell? I gotta, I gotta log it. What the hell is this? What? All right, so it just, nice little, nice load screen and then it crashed. That's, 
Okay. And Dashing Dinos, the final Polish turd on the list for today. This game actually looks like it has some promise, man. We got Deathmatch. We got the prehistoric equivalent of Hit It and Quit It. We got Capture the Egg. We got just soccer last dino standing we're gonna do some deathmatch here we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna play on a random map and uh and we're gonna play against some ai here because i don't actually have any friends to play this game with me Three, two, one, yeah. Yeah. the game the game the game froze <laughs> the fucking game froze what do i do what, what do I do here? That's some functionality right there. Am I actually, am I actually gonna have to do this? Do I really have to open a task manager for this? This game just straight up bricked my PC. Dude, it's actually been like five minutes. I can't get, I can't get my task manager to open. I don't know how to cancel this game out. I was excited for this, man. Okay, so it's actually been like six minutes and uh, nothing is changing. I just got this repeating, really upbeat, mosquito sounding music in my ear, so. I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um, I don't really know how to fix this. I'm probably just gonna have to get a new PC because it seems like the dashing dinos broke the one that I had. Thank all of you beautiful people for spending a few minutes of your day with me today. I'm back to normal uploads now. I hope you guys have a great day. And and, and let me know, let me know what your favorite game was here. And uh, I, I hated all of these. These were all pretty bad today. <laughs> have a great day guys. I'll see you in the next video. Before I said